So guys, welcome back to another edition of Morts and More Moment. In today's episode, we're going to do another star salute. Yeah. And today, it goes to the one and only Conor McGregor. Yeah. Now, for those of you who don't know who Conor McGregor is, he is the UFC featherweight, featherweight, right? Featherweight. Featherweight, featherweight yeah. champion. Um, and it, for any of you who watch UFC or who may, you might not even watch UFC, but if you've heard his name, you'll know the type of guy that he is. He's yeah. big, he's bold, he's just audacious in everything he does and the way he fights, including his dress sense. Yeah, um, yeah. and so, um, do you want to talk about him, Josh? Yeah, I mean, look, like, I'm a fan of um, I'm a fan of Conor McGregor's style, should I say. I, I think I, just to be honest, I think I'm one of the newcomers because I didn't really hear about him until probably about a year ago. Mm, was you, the first you time put I, me up. Yeah, right? I probably heard him about a year ago, and he's been around for a, little, a few years now. Mm. And I think the first thing that struck me was not only the fact that he was good at what he did, but he was so bold. He was just like he, he reminded me of like uh, Mayweather slash Ali, like so mm. audacious in the way he approached his um, his opponents and his fights. But then where I first saw him was Instagram. And on his Instagram, you saw him posing in so many different suits. I was thinking, hold on, these suits yeah. look quite yeah. quite good. Like, so obviously, most of his suits are tailored. His style is out there, it's bold, just as his personality is, as Senna stated. And that is the number one thing when it comes to dressing well and, and obviously embodying your style is that you're able to present your own characteristics and your own personality. And he does that very, very well. There was one suit in particular that I really did like. Well, one combination that he put together which was like a cream suit a sky blue shirt and um, like an Irish green tie and pocket square man that was that was awesome really like that look um, but he's had quite a few yeah he's, had I love few. His, he, he's got a love for checks yeah you know he loves a Glen plaid various different colors the bow ties yeah uh, you know he really goes in um, on his outfits and you can just you know he's again one of those guys you can cut off his head and I could be like, you know what? Just from his pose and the type of outfit, I can be like, that's Conor McGregor. Yeah, the pose, um, the pose in particular. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The, the most awkward looking poses, but he does them and he does it on purpose, it he seems. He pulls it off, I guess. He pulls it off. Yeah. I just, what I love about Conor McGregor is everything he does has a purpose, you know? Even the way he talks, he's very much like, this is what I'm going to do. Yeah. And he makes it happen, you know. I equate, I actually equate him. He's like the um, the Harvey Specter of yeah, the MMA yeah. world. Okay, you know okay. when Harvey Specter says, "I'm gonna beat you," <laughs> I'm gonna do it in style, it's and this is, you know, it's gonna happen. It's a wrap. That's Conor yeah, McGregor. Yeah. If he says, "I'm gonna knock you out in the first round," um, in this way, so far he's done it. I remember in one of his press releases recently, he said they asked him, "Well, look, how are you able to predict all these things that happen in your fights, and how are you so successful?" Right, and he said to them, "Well, look, if you can see it in here, mm-hmm. and you have the courage enough to say it here, then it can happen." And I thought that was very, very, very inspirational. Yeah. So I took something from that. That's for sure. Yeah. So and, and yeah. you know that's what. So even some of our star salutes aren't just based on how people dress, because there's many people out there who dress well. Yeah. It's also about the type of person they are, what they embody, and what they, you know, what they bring to the wider forum. Yeah. And um, yeah. I love his. The thing with him, to beat him, you have to beat him mentally. Yeah, psychologically. Um, yeah. And psychological. That, yeah. Psycholo- <laughs> Sorry, I'm just forget. You know. Do you want to try again? Nah, you know what I mean. No? I'm not okay. going to do it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and um, you know that goes for a lot of people in business, um, in various sectors of the world. You have to be strong psychologically to be successful, and I just love that about his character. Yeah. When it comes to his style. Everything seems to be thought about. The combinations are just, they're not for everybody, no, no, no. but they are for him. Exactly. And for that reason, he gets to those Star Salute, for yeah. sure. Notorious. That's today's Star Salute done, guys. Uh, we hope that you found it interesting. Um, let us know if there's anybody who you think deserves a Star Salute that we should talk about. Yeah. Um, and then, yeah, um, as always, any questions or comments, leave them in the comment box below. Um, send us any questions over to ask at mortsandmore.com. And then you can also find us on various social media channels. So from YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, mm-hmm. LinkedIn, yeah. Twitter. Yes. And yeah, follow us. Tell your friends. Tell your friends to tell your friends. Yeah. To tell their friends. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, until next time. <laughs> until next time.
to and secondly also making sure that they're hi guys welcome Ha <laughs> <laughs>